Hey, I am Nilesh, a partner engineer at Meta. Today I am going to show you how to build your own chatbot for your business in WhatsApp using Llama. Building intelligent chatbot on WhatsApp can be a great way to enhance your services or product offerings. You may want your bot to handle different types of data, such as images and audio, and be ready to support more users as your business grows. As you scale, you might also want your chatbot to connect with other tools or platforms you already use, like CRMs, databases, or analytics dashboards. In this video, I'll walk you through the process to integrate your services with a WhatsApp chatbot using Llama 4 to handle multiple use cases. To achieve this setup, we'll build an end-to-end -end recipe that enables you to build your own AI assistant on WhatsApp using Llama 4's native multimodal capabilities. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to build an assistant that can seamlessly accept text, image, and audio queries and generate responses using Llama 4, all within a unified, scalable experience. Not only will you come away with your own assistants, but this recipe demonstrates how Llama can be used to transform customer communication by breaking down barriers between different types of contents so that you can build your own application using this Llama capability. First, let's examine the architecture. When a user interacts with a business on WhatsApp, those interactions go through the WhatsApp business platform to our fast API backend. In our demonstration, we use cloud-based services to process images, text, and audio interactions from the business customers. The architecture includes dedicated module for images, text, and audio, all integrated with Llama 4's language understanding capabilities. For audio, we utilize high-speed speech-to-text and text-to-speech APIs, while WhatsApp Media Storage leverages WhatsApp's native storage and Facebook Graph API for seamless content handling. Keep in mind, you are free to choose alternative APIs or cloud services to access models or handle media processing. These are simply the options we have selected for this example. Before you build your WhatsApp Llama 4 bot, make sure you have the following prerequisites. First, set up your WhatsApp business platform. Start by registering as a Meta developer by creating an account at developer.meta.com, then follow the WhatsApp business platform cloud API get started guide. This will walk you through adding your WhatsApp to your business app, registering a recipient phone number, and sending a test message to make sure everything is working. Next, you will need a way to test your webhook. For this, you will want a publicly accessible URL that WhatsApp can use to send webhook events to your backend. There are several ways to do this. Just choose a method that works for your environment and security needs. You will also need API access for a few core services. First, an API key for your Llama model provider. In this demo, we are using Together AI, but you can choose any provider you prefer. Second, an API key for speech-to-text and text-to-speech services if you want your bot to handle audio. And third, if you are deploying your backend in cloud, make sure you have credentials for your choosing cloud provider. Finally, grab your WhatsApp business credentials. From the Meta for Developer Apps dashboard, note down your temporary access token, your phone number ID, and recipient phone number. You will need these to connect your bot to WhatsApp. Our implementation consists of several key components working together seamlessly. Webhook configuration. The system begins with a webhook setup using fast API endpoints. The webhook validates using a verify token and processes different messages types such as text, images, and audio, routing them to appropriate handler. Backend services. This example backend runs on AWS EC2 instances with dedicated services for each processing types. The ec2services.py module manages API call to Together AI for model responses as well as all audio processing, including speech-to-text and text-to-speech using Grox services. Please note that you are free to use alternative STD and TTS services based upon the requirements. These are just the options we have chosen for this demonstration. The ec2services.py modules also handles WhatsApp media attachments via Facebook Graph APIs. The ec2endpoint.py module exposes fast API endpoint and routes incoming messages to appropriate processing functions. Once you set up the logic in the respective files, here is how you can get your bot up and running. First, clone Llama Cookbook repository and change the directory to WhatsApp Llama 4 bot. Then install the required dependencies by running the pip install requirement.txt in your product directory to make sure you have all necessary Python packages. Next, 
configure your environment variables. You will need to add your API keys and credentials to the .env file. This includes your WhatsApp business API, access token and phone number ID, your Llama 4 API keys, your API key for speech processing, and your cloud credentials if you are deploying over a specific cloud. Finally, deploy and start the server. You can launch the backend by running uvcon command as mentioned here. This will start your fast API server and make it accessible for incoming WhatsApp messages. The system is designed to generate a detailed log and can handle multiple users at once. Automatically scaling as per demand increases. The WhatsApp Llama 4 integration demonstrates how multimodal AI can transform customer communication by seamlessly handling text, voice, and images interaction in a unified conversational experience. By leveraging Llama 4's advanced reasoning with WhatsApp, Businesses can provide immediate, intelligent assistant that understands and responds across all communication formats, whether it's text, image, or audio. You can explore the complete implementation in Llama Cookbook repository at end-to-end -end use cases section. This includes detailed setup instruction, configuration examples, webhook implementation guide, and best practices for production deployment. This serves as a comprehensive foundation that you can customize for specific use cases whether for customer support automation, personal AI assistance, or interactive business communication. Thanks for watching. Get started with WhatsApp Llama 4 multimodal chatbot development on llama.com and start building your own intelligent conversational experiences today. We are actively developing new features and capabilities, so join us on GitHub and Discord to stay up to date. We can't wait to see what you built.